Jonas Wengegaard, congratulations. You've just won the, the Critérium du Dauphiné. What does that, uh, what does it mean for you? Yeah. It's of course very, very big for me to, uh, to win this race. It's uh, one of the biggest races in the world. So, uh, so of course, I'm very, very happy to, to win. And uh, once again, the, the team did amazing today. They were really super, super strong and uh, I was never alone. So, uh, so yeah, that was uh, completely perfect what they, what they did today. Yeah, tell us about, uh, about this day and especially about the final climb. It, you seemed under control. Yeah, I mean, uh, we, uh, I had teased there for the downhill and for the first part and then, uh, yeah, I think also Yates wanted to go fast, so uh, Micah was on the front and, uh, yeah, I was feeling good and uh, then, I, then I tried in the end. A word on the uh, GC, the general classification, the gaps are huge uh, over Adam Yates, uh, over uh, Ben O'Connor. Um, you must be very satisfied. Yeah, I mean, I think I can be very satisfied with this, with, with the whole week. Um, I've, I think I'm in, in, in good shape, and uh, yeah, in general, the, the whole team wrote fantastically in the in the in the last week. Are you surprised that the gaps are so big? Yeah, in some kind of way, yes. Uh, I knew I was in good shape, but uh, yeah. What are the plans now for the weeks to come? We know, of course, you have the the Tour de France in the back of your mind. What are the plans now? Yeah, now I. Uh, Relax a few days and then I uh, start preparing the last, uh, the last bit for uh, for the Tour de France. A lot of work to be done. Well, I mean, uh, I don't know if it's a lot of work. I think I I still have a little bit of work to do, but uh, not a lot of work. Thank you very much. Congratulations.